Alrighty, well, morning everybody, and cast time once again. And, um, like has been going on, there's, uh, there's gonna be a bunch of moving parts in this one here, so just get ready for some mistakes to be made. Um, but let me go ahead and intro this music. This is, uh, Stone Age Mammoth, uh, Earthborn. So this is gonna be some, uh, stoner rock from Greece. So, yeah, some Greek stoner rock. Let me pause, let me pause. Oh, there we go. The, the video froze up on me, so. So, anyway, um. Hey, and off to a good start. Okay. Anyway, um, I decided to go ahead and do another pinball stream. Um, just uh, figured I figured I'm only gonna be streaming for like two or three hours anyway, so no big, you know, not that big of a deal. But uh, stream actually went pretty good, and I think I need to turn this down a little bit. Okay, there we go. But yeah, anyway, stream went stream went pretty good. Um, it actually went better than yesterday. Uh, but, um, in fact, um, I even, um, quote unquote, accidentally, uh, beat a high score, too. I just tried to ride along, just playing good and everything, but I was thinking, um, uh, I was thinking my high score was a lot higher than it actually was, but by the time I got through, by the time I got through with the table, it was just. Oh damn! I beat. Oh damn! I, I beat the high score. Okay, like I mean, I thought my high score was like like around three million or something like that. Like it was like a obscenely high, something I'd never be able to get again. But oh, apparently I did. So, ah, uh, but uh, but as far as uh, as far as that goes, I'm I'm thinking today, again due to my uh apartment inspection, more on that later. Um, there's probably not gonna be a not gonna be a stream today, so yeah, cause I'm gonna need to lay back down after all. Uh, after basically spinning my wheels for most of the afternoon, waiting for my apartment inspection to be over with. So um, but otherwise. After the stream, though, just if, um, for the most part, spent most of the evening, um, good chunk of the night, just trying to get my apartment cleaned up. Um, I didn't really do a super duper deep cleaning or anything like that. Just, you know, try to get the obvious stuff. Um, you know, try to get the stuff that I thought they'd see. Man, I think I made a bad music choice. It's almost too distracting. Yeah, I have to actually turn it down. Usually I have to usually I have to turn it up so I can hear. So But anyway, like I said, um spent um spent uh, a good chunk of the evening and a good chunk of the night just trying to get my apartment cleaned up but um at some point later on I just kind of said fuck it and but uh there's also the matter of two uh I have a neighbor below me so I most certainly can't do anything in my bedroom I can't work on that because that's where my neighbor's at directly below me so I can't really do much there So I'll probably have to. I'll probably I'll probably lay down, um, or lay down at my usual time, like around five ish, and then uh, I actually have my alarm set for like 10 a.m. instead of like 1 p.m. So just you know, just gotta wake up early, 
I'll do whatever extra cleaning I need to do. Oh, yeah, but... And I totally forgot what I was going to say, too. Brain kind of farted. But yeah, basically, I did part of it last night. I'll do most, if not the rest of it, um, this morning. So. Um, and then um, um, played some more Idol Champs. But like I said, I think I'm uh, like I said yesterday, I think I'm burning out on the game. It's getting to where I'll just. I'll set it up. I'll set it up for, uh, for autopilot and just shut the game down. So it just goes in offline mode. So that... Well, excuse me. That pretty much tells me that uh, I'm probably going to be looking into something else to play. I don't know what, though. I'm, uh, I'm going to take a drink of some Arizona green tea. One other thing I wanted to look at. No. Alright. This is gonna be a problem here. If I can't get this little menu thingy off uh, off the bottom here, I might end up abandoning this part of the cast. So. Um, another article by Jessica Wildfire. I read a really small part of this and I figured um I haven't done one of these in a while. Uh, just doing commentary on this article, but... Yeah, the year will end in moral warfare and hardship. Uh, for some reason, I'm not surprised. Yeah, you... You'd had to have lived under a pretty big rock if you hadn't noticed this. Ah, yeah, this is what got me interested. While Americans bicker over a slap at the Oscars, this is one of the reasons why I why I hardly ever pay attention to current events. It's like it's like a culture of making a mountain out of a molehill. I mean, I, I I think I watched a little bit of it. Like during the Oscars, Will Smith went up and slapped up or slapped up Chris Rock because of some uh, remark he made, he made about his wife. I guess she's like, she's got cancer or something. She's bald from the chemo. At least that's what I'm guessing. But like I said, I mean, it. it's the kind of thing that just goes in one eye and out the other. So. But yeah. Our economy and our democracy are crumbling. I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna try to go through this quickly, but uh, it doesn't always work that way. But there it is. Yeah, it's to where I don't pay attention that much anymore either. It seems to be our new normal now. Don't surprise me. Er, basically, we're viewing it as pretty much entertainment, in other words. Let's get over to the question of people's intelligence. Or his reputation as an evil super <laughs> super villain chef's master. Muddle his way through Ukraine just like he just did. Putin doesn't have to worry about civil civilian casualties or public opinion. Yup. Shelling and bobbing until he walks away with 
some kind of victory. Someone else has a lack of stock of the world for once. Surprise, surprise. Mo most of this I don't pay attention to. Prices on everything have gone way up. Uh oh. I know gas prices shot through the roof. I don't know about everything else, though. Hmm. Hmm. Stop buying stuff. Layoffs and the implosion of. Might have to look into mine then, see how it's doing. Yep. Bad call. Bailing out the big banks and whatnot. Basically helping the bad guys stay in business, and in the end, we pay for it. Avian flu is going to crush the poultry industry. Yup, um, I think it was, um, my last work week, um, we had no eggs, um, uh, like, no eggs, you know, to, for customers to buy, like, none whatsoever. Um, apparently they had to, they had to kill their current batch of eggs because, uh, all the, uh, all the chickens that were laying them all had the flu. Apparently, all the chickens had avian flu. Oh, no, wait, let me, I take that back. Um, last Wednesday and Thursday, we had no eggs whatsoever. Oh, and for those that don't know, I worked the overnight shift at Walmart. So, that's kind of how I know about this. But, yeah, uh, Wednesday and Thursday, there were uh, no eggs at all. Uh, Friday, I think, probably like 10 cases of, uh, yeah, about 10 cases of eggs came in, and that's it. So. Mm -hmm. Damn, yawning a lot. So I guess, uh, Britain has it the worst, apparently. Yep, this don't surprise me. Pay attention to bird flu until the price of their eggs and their chicken breasts hit nosebleed levels. And... Oh shoot, I just thought of this. Someone pulls a gun on a fast food worker outside Chick-fil-A. Um, I can't recall any exact incidents, but yeah, I'm... this kind of thing has happened before. been a long time since we've had a recession, major war, and multiple pandemics going on at the same time. Yeah. I don't really follow politics, so this is going to kind of go over my head. Uh, demos are going to lose the midterms. Rent. 
Americans always want to punish the party in charge. Yep. And more often not than not, I've said this in other cast videos, and they're always looking for that one single reason why. It's like the cause of all the woes of the country is all tied into one single reason. Which, no, that's not the case. It's just, it, in a word, or short answer, Z, all the above. I mean, you can't, you can't fix the woes of the country just by electing a socialist in office. I mean, that alone is not gonna, it's not gonna right all the wrongs of the country. I mean, there's a lot more to it than that. So yeah, but it's kind of a corollary to what she's saying here. Joe, why are you yawning? This. I never look forward to November. Yeah, I can see this happening too. I mean, the uh, the Capitol riot of last year. To bad omen. But take another drink. You mean there wasn't one already? I got a feeling that probably one of the most evil companies out there, Monsanto, they're probably going to get a, I believe that they're the company that you, uh, farmers get their fertilizer from, I think. But yeah, at any rate, the raw materials are probably, uh, are probably provided by only one company, so... California is a canary in the coal mine. Ouch. The plan is to let people starve so the rich can eat filet mignon. No surprises there. It's been that way since God knows how long. It's let them eat bugs. Um, don't, I don't really follow this, so going to be another one of those that's going to go over my head. Flying warplanes in Taiwan's airspace. Okay. Taiwanese tech and talent when it comes to semiconductor chips. Okay, I guess. I guess... I want us a place to get them or something. I don't know. Like I said, I I don't really follow this. Yeah. Surprise! China. I guess that's on the horizon. Man, will you get out of there? Duh. Yeah. Okay, um... Western propaganda will soar. That don't surprise me. Stories on analysis how bad in China and Russia are doing. Push the noise. 
That don't surprise me either. Yeah. Again, this... This whole thing don't surprise me. Gotta help keep those big companies... Gotta help keep those big companies in business. So. Yeah. Okay, uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and skim the rest of this. Um, I, you know, I'm going to kind of go out on a limb here, but I'll bet this whole thing could have been stopped probably, probably right around the 1800s when the, uh, Industrial Revolution was in full swing and, uh, they were, uh, coming up with scientific evidence way back then that, uh, this whole thing was causing climate change, at least theoretically. We could have stopped it way back when, but I kind of get what she says here, though. We blew it. Okay. So... I kind of went a little over long on it, but... Otherwise, um, that's going to do it for me. Um, that's, that's all I got. So, um, and this will be my last cast for the week. So, um, this, this is when my work week is started up. Um, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. Um, those are my work nights. So, so you probably, assuming I don't call in on any one of those days, um, you won't be hearing from me again until Sunday morning. But otherwise, hey, thanks for uh, tuning in and listening to me, though, everybody. I appreciate that. And again, um, uh, barring incident, I, you shouldn't be hearing from me again until Sunday morning. So, but until then, though, thanks again for coming by, everybody, and see you all next time. Bye for now.